What is up YouTube and welcome to this flash video. As always, if you are new, please do click that subscribe button. It really, really does mean a lot. Of course, as well as always, if you are a current subscriber, please do click that bell button so you never miss a video. So welcome people to this video. So flash is getting good. It is a very interesting last few episodes this season now there has been some very interesting points of time travel relativity time loops and multiverses etc and that really has actually got me thinking will we ever see the original timeline of the flash so if you will remember the whole thing at the start of all the way back in episode one of season one we had Eobard Thorne arrive in our time. And, well, we had Eobard Thorne kill poor old Barry's mother, which is a huge homage to the DC Flash Rebirth story. Not the current DC Rebirth, but the Rebirth of a decade ago when we had the DC Comics creators obsessed with rebooting and rebirthing all of our characters because we had the Green Lantern Rebirth, which was amazing. And we had the Flash Rebirth, which was absolutely stunning. And gave us that modern version of the Flash that we have now. And much of the stories, such as the Black Flash. We have Savitar being destroyed. We have all of these stories, quite a few of them, introduced here in that comic. So, the... The thing that I really am curious about is, will we see the timeline that we were meant to have? So, as we know, if you're a fan, The Flash was meant to become The Flash in 2020, not the year that he did in Episode 1. So, he was... Well, time was completely changed. As Eobard Thorne found out, he realised that, well, he's come to the wrong time, and this is the reason that he's really wanted to mentor Barry and create and make him fast so he could get himself back to the future where he wanted to be. Now, there are a main, many, many different reasons why I want to see this timeline play out, at least in flashbacks or flash sideways or something like that. I want to see it, so I'll explain what actually happened. So, in 2024, this was the story that we had where the Flash disappears so the flash disappears he's with ray palmer hawk girl and all that and he's fighting the reverse flash and then just disappears now this is where our friend earbud thorn goes back in time and goes and successfully kills nora allen so i am intrigued because i want to know just what happened Mainly because we would see more of the Reverse Flash, who is one of my favourite characters on the show, and also in the Flash comics, because I find him the most intriguing. So I want to see him originally come back to our time. I want to see him realise that, looking at the Flash Museum, and realise that, well, he is actually the villain of this show. He is, in the future, absolutely obsessed with, with Barry Allen and the Speed Force, but alas, he goes back in time and discovers, well, he is a dick. He's a massive douchebag. And I want to see that. I want to see this origin of the Reverse Flash, Eobard Thorn on the show. I really do want to see that. And I think it would really, really work. And I kind of think that it would be a good way to kind of get out of this Savitar story. It would be a good way to get out of this time loop. I think it would be pretty cool if they ended Flashpoint, if they ended this whole season of Flashpoint, which really, when you think about it, it actually is. This is Flashpoint, albeit Barry's parents are still totally fucking worm food. So I think that would be interesting if at the end we see this timeline, if only maybe for a few episodes, I'll accept for a few episodes, but we could change the show and it could reinvent itself as we see this timeline. And we kind of join them as they are. But well. 
all of these characters have their same relationships, albeit we could then have flashbacks and actually see what went on in those intervening years between when Barry disappeared and when he first became the Flash. I thought that would be pretty cool. Let me know in the comments if you think that that would be cool, if you'd be interested in that. Now, realistically, I'm not so sure if we would ever get this timeline I think that we'll probably see that maybe in a flash sideway or the very, very least, it will actually be referenced by Eobard Thorne. I think that he will mention this because a lot of you are thinking that Reverse Flash isn't actually dead, which is an interesting concept. And for me, I hope he isn't actually dead. And now it would be really nice to see him kind of explain what was meant to happen so bear with me here so at the end of this season the fight is finished savatar is kind of dead or we're coming to the end of this and then the reverse flash reappears and then explains how time was meant to be and then we get an explanation of just what the hell is going on so the reverse flash can explain how time was meant to be and possibly barry can have a choice he can have how it was meant to be or carry on in this world. Now, I know this is a long shot, but it is a really interesting thing because we could really learn the origins of who he was meant to be and time could sort of fix itself. Now, granted, I'm of the opinion that possibly time is so fucked up due to the Time Masters actually being killed on the Legends of Tomorrow. So they're not around to kind of guide time and make sure it's going correctly. So let me know in the comments what you think of that theory as well. And also, would you want to see this original timeline? So that's it for this video. Please do drop a like, please do subscribe, and I'll see you soon. And goodbye.